Welcome back to Footed Raba. Last time we got together with Himari. Finally. And now. I believe we're in front of her house. She should be out any minute now. Hopefully. Long day after Himari and I became a couple. I'm excited and ready to enjoy a walk to school with my new girlfriend. So I'm making use of my boyfriend privilege. It's hard to do something that normally be legally questionable. <laughs> Loiter outside her house. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know too many people that would that would enjoy that. Unless they specifically gave you permission to do so. She messaged me five minutes ago saying she'd be leaving for school in a bit. <laughs> Any second now, I'll see my target exit the front door with that nonchalant expression of hers. Where, oh, where is my Himari? <laughs> I'm so excited! Just can't wait any longer. Sheesh. I just woke up and now I'm about to give myself a fucking heart attack from all the excitement. It's taking you so long, Himari! Please hurry, come on out already! I whip out my phone and shoot her another message? Maybe those hardened feelings from last night's confession still have more enough on me. Oh, wait, does it hard feel- no. Maybe those feelings from last night's confession still have more enough on me. Maybe that's why I'm so exhilarated right now. Both my mind and body are in this strange sort of agitation, and that's the only cause I can think of. And here we go. There she is! Hey, Marty! I missed you so much! Yeah! Starting off really strong there, dude. Wait, why is she running away? Stop right there, evildoer! I'll shoot you if you keep running! Well, I wanted to give you a bit of a surprise, that's why I was waiting out here. <laughs> Himari, I thought you would know by now that I am far from normal. Ha ha ha, you're awful cute. You know, the way you look when you're all flustered like that. I love it. Himari! <laughs> Hey, how could you? You can't just say... You can't just say things like that to your new boyfriend? Here we go. <coughs> Murray plugs my mouth shut. Uh-huh. <sighs> Don't give me that sigh of relief. Well, what the hell? You just... You just thrust that... That thing into my mouth? I spit out an excessively huge stuffed hamster. Oi! No pulling! <laughs> For some reason, I find myself getting dragged away by Imari. Oh, boy. It only took mere minutes for our first day as a couple to start off on a sour note. Yeah, whose fault is that? Oi, haven't you dragged me far enough by now? Let go already! <laughs> With that, she frees me. What's that for? Sheesh! We're gonna hold hands on our way to school, that's the wrong way to do it! Oh. He has a huffy meter. 
Hmm. A seven? What? What now? I really want to ask her some questions about that Huffy meter of hers. あ、ないで。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。
leave it to me to get the hiccups in the middle of a recording. Uh, and since this is Yoko-san we're talking about here, she could utilize some method we know nothing of to keep us under constant surveillance 24-7. Oh, dear God, you're right. Sorry, uh, that I would not want, so... Yeah, I guess you don't want them finding out. <laughs> yeah, but if they, if either of their friends see us holding hands or, you know, doing whatever in the street, they're gonna, they're gonna report back. I can just see it now. Yeah. Well, I guess I better not go waiting outside her house anymore then. I honestly should have realized all the bad things that, it, that could have happened. I guess that's how, just how crazy I am about Himari right now. Or just how crazy in general you are. I wish I knew how I was supposed to sing it. <coughs> hmm? Yeah. Himari no uta. Himari no uta. Ay, 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 you're just the cutest thing ever. I receive a Hima Hima Bon Chess Punishment. <laughs> Personally, I think you're embarrassed faced or sulky face and her I'm not happy with you right now, face and sir. Seriously cute. He really is. I mean, I understand he's ecstatic about finally getting a girlfriend, but dude, rein it in a little bit. <clears throat> well, of course I am. It's the first day of school with my new girlfriend. Who wouldn't be energetic? Oh, and uh... <clears throat> While we're talking about people that really shouldn't find out about this, there's a certain Astro Boy looking ass that we really shouldn't tell this to. I've been super hyper since last night. The joy is literally bursting out of me. Do you not feel happy? <laughs> <sighs> there may be two notches at this point. Okay. Um... <clears throat> my guest. I would endure any torture to see that adorable face. God, he's a masochist. <sighs> yeah, but see, I'm, I'm the good kind of weird. You could be going out with another weird guy, and um, he's the really bad kind of weird. I'm sure you know who I'm talking about. <laughs> you you don't like me? <laughs> For some reason, my girlfriend suddenly gets all fidgety. That's definitely understandable. Uh, 
私たちのことは内緒に。And there it is. Okay. Few seconds later. <coughs> All right, everyone. Hot news coming right at you. Mina Hara and I are dating now. Well, so much for that. Of course. There's a petty some bitch. Everyone in the classroom instantly freezes up in response to my sudden announcement. Huh? <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah, that's how things are. So I don't want to see any of you stinking guys near my girl from now on. Dude. Freeze up a little bit. A lot, actually. <gasps> and. Dead silence. <clears throat> All right, now to the next classroom. What the fuck? <laughs> Sorry, Himari, but this is something I can't compromise on. I know with almost certainty that there are guys out there who have their eyes on her. I mean, who would? If we don't make our relationship status clear to everyone, I am very positive it'll bring trouble later on. Trouble from fuckers like Genki. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> and speak up the fucker. <laughs> Surprisingly, no. <laughs> well, I guess those reactions were basically what I expected. But unfortunately for them, as odd as it may seem, the truth is the truth. At least someone's happy for me. Suspicions? What are you talking about? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it was I. It was I who did the confessing. False. She confessed to me. Bullshit. <laughs> we just got another Hima Hima bunch. Hey, Momo's right there. Just get past his love for... Love for the amphibious and he'll be fine. <clears throat> but, uh... If you dress up like a lizard, then, um, might wanna... <laughs> yes, sir. Girls took it positively for the most part. Though, on the other hand, the guys, at the exception of Momo, were visibly not too thrilled 
which I guess is only natural. Okay, but, um... <clears throat> what about Machopi? How did he feel? He would then each bombarded the questions after question for a while, and as a result, Himari ended up being surrounded by girls all throughout classes. How they're already doing this, huh? Seriously. Morning classes came to an end and we're now in lunch break. News, is, news about us spread through the school like wildfire. Yeah, I wonder why. And now the people sitting beyond us are whispering about it like crazy. <clears throat> Uh, I swear, those girls are heartless. Come in aside. I don't really regret it or anything. Yeah, of course you don't. If, if it was you on the receiving end of that, you... Well, you know, he'd probably be ecstatic, to be honest. I don't see any benefit for us to keep keeping it a secret. Besides, besides, ah, I'm I'll go, but I'll all go away in due time. Anyhow, since I'm already embarrassed enough already, uh, anyway. There's a certain piece of information about my girlfriend I feel the need to obtain. And that is what? Moshi <clears throat> Moshi, Onomoto Tomomi. Huh? Being Himari's best friend, uh, there's a little something I'd like to ask you about. Uh, I think I already know what it is. Yeah, you're her closest friend. Just for future reference, um... Oh. Okay, well, that was the second thing I thought of. Uh, <laughs> I need to know her three sizes. Uh, dude. Himari's gonna... Hima Hima punch your ass in the next week and uh Yeah. Mosimoshi? Tomomi ni nani o kiteru no kana? Himari, I'm only doing this so I can be prepared. Be prepared for what? Reina's right. I can be a real dumbass. Just like right now. <clears throat> nah, she can't. Her punches don't even hurt. Yet. Uh huh. <laughs> Doesn't hurt one bit, yeah, see? <laughs> Hell, the way she was pulling, putting her muscle into it nonetheless is super endearing. Yeah, he's really not thinking today. I mean, he is, but he's the wrong head. Well, it was just embarrassing to ask you directly. Why? And besides, it's better to prepare myself now. You know, for things later down the road. Oh. Zikai? Maji? 
I uh, want some excitement in our relationship, damn it. I want to have a fulfilling adolescence here! You're really asking him that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> she told me off, but, well, that was only natural. Our relationship is now a known thing among our classmates, at least. The plan has been successful. Now we just gotta worry about the other two. Um. Roadblocks. でも本当に外だよね。だってあんたと皆原さんってそんなに話してなかったよね。そうそう。少し仲がいいように見えた時もあるけど、それがまさか付き合うなんて。ねえ、ひまひま。何よ。私からは何も言うことなんてないもん。then I will answer in her stead. Yeah, and you're surprised at that? Really? Hmm. Hearing you say that means we want to mix in a couple of alternative truths here and there. Dude, she's gonna murder you. And by murder you, I mean give you a flurry of Hima Hima punches until... <laughs> I am only kidding, my dear Himari. Light punches rain down on my chest. They don't hurt at all, though. Hell, look at her face, it's making me laugh. <laughs> Good grief, my cute little Himari just always has to get worked up over every little thing. <laughs> I'm sorry! Forgive me! Well, shit. I'll only say the truth, so please forgive me! Seriously, dude, it's only... it's only day one. ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそうさま。ごちそ
want to do things couples do. Not just at school, but all sorts of other places too. <laughs> huh? I wasn't supposed to make her laugh. Did, did I say something funny? So you loved all the teasing I gave you this morning. Huh. Oh, so you aren't upset? Not even a tiny bit. I mean, when I asked Nanamura about your you-know-what, you... True. My hand! I was entirely ready to take the initiative, but she just took it. What is this feeling? It's like a surge of embarrassment. Uh, I can't think straight! I don't know what it is! Point being, I feel super, super embarrassed. Ooh. Ah. Deep breaths. Deep breaths. Allow myself to get too hyper like this morning. I used to be ruining everything I sought out to fix. It's, it's more than enough for me. When you tell me something like that, I'm the one dying of embarrassment. Don't tell me that was your plan all along. I am. <clears throat> so with this tantalization, it's eating at me. She has to be doing this on purpose. If I set my excitement loose. Ah, damn. That's too much. This guy has no middle ground for his emotions. He's either super depressed or super excited. Free hand and puts your index finger on my lips and seal my mouth. <laughs> Is this girl trying to kill me? I never thought she'd be the type to do that. So now my heart's hammering in my chest like mad. Taken, completely taken control of the situation. Just one of those sly and cunning girls. Rare breed itself. No idea if there's an actual name for that or something. I definitely feel these words describe her. Slowly start to walk again, hand in hand. <laughs> yep, he is. Oh, buzz off. Why are you being so mean to me? Jeez. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, I could tell. Your face is like the brightest red imaginable, let me tell you. I'm actually still a little red. <laughs> Okie dokie. <laughs> Gotta say, your hand is smaller than I thought. Seems like you really take care of your hands. It's silky smooth. That was a lukewarm reaction to you. Dear. <laughs> what did you do? Expect her to ball her eyes out like you do? <clears throat> now I feel like a gigantic, gigantic idiot for being worried at all. She says she loves me and even holds hands with me like this. Somewhat avoids putting it too directly into words, but I still feel like her feelings are crystal clear. The warmth of that hand I'm holding onto tells me so. Sunset afterglow, then nightfall. Ah, No idea if that was how I was supposed to sing it, but I. whatever. Yeah, I remember my mommy would always get real mad if I wasn't home by the time it rang. So I'd have to run home as fast as I could. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I don't have to worry about getting scolded anymore for stuff like that, obviously. <laughs> and I lightly squeeze her hands while humming. She may look a little bit childish herself at times like this. So it's kind of funny that she thinks she's in a position to call me that. Damn it! This is too much. Can't take seeing her like this for any longer. Himari. I just can't anymore. I can't wait any longer. <laughs> Talking about containing my excitement! He's been acting too damn cute, I can't take it anymore! We start to swing our hands back and forth. Oh my god, what is your deal, Himari? I do not understand you! Trying to have me OD on cuteness? <laughs> Despite me swinging her hand so much, Himari keeps firmly holding my hand, not letting go. Man, am I glad to have her as my girlfriend. As that thought uh, occupied my mind, we merrily made our way home from school. got a question for you. So they just showed a TV special about relationships. Types are great, be that way for me. You manage my cell. What? Um. 
what did I just choose? <laughs> When it comes down to it, that controlling nature essentially results from extreme love for the other person, right? Um, I think that depends, my guy. I won't say no to that, Himari. I'd welcome it. Yeah, dude, seriously. <laughs> Going as far as managing your cell phone would be... would definitely be too crazy. I get the feeling like something like that would only annoy you, and I don't want that. I want to love me and trust me, so I wouldn't want to act controlling. I want to aim to be a good girlfriend that's deserving of your trust, yes. I'm so happy I might just cry. I'm so glad I confessed to her. She's too good for this world. I'll aim to be a good boyfriend that can make you happy. And send. Though, so, what kind of man would be able to make her happy? Spend the rest of the night texting with Himari while pondering that question. <laughs> okay. So, first day of class as a boyfriend and girlfriend. Uh, somewhat successful. Although, I, uh... Well, okay, he was a bit over-excited and... Very cringy, I might add. But, uh... From this dialogue, it looks like we're going on a date today, so... Next time date will be had, and maybe it will be the water park episode for this route. We'll just have to see. What the fuck? So, until next time, uh, don't be a dick to your significant other, especially if it's all like Himari, or the other girls, and, uh, on rocket.